just on we just finished having lunch on the deck just up up there at the house and then uh, we saw the guys in the water yelling out for help and so yeah we just came down and got in the water and, and just went out there the man here was here first I got down I saw the boat from where I lived just up top of the road and the boat had gone over and there were these two guys in the water and I didn't see any life jackets between them um, so I ran into my garage, grabbed the life jackets I've got at home and, and ran down and um, he was already out there with the, with the guys trying to keep one of their heads up. The other one was floundering around a bit so I just made a beeline as fast as I could out to them um, and just chucked my life jackets over and the guy with the, um, with the bodyboard came up and gave me a hand. But this man saved one of their lives man, straight up. We just sw swam out and um, got a hold of the guys and tried to sort of keep them calm yeah, and, uh, and slowly work our way in. Oof, there was another girl that we swam out with. She got there slightly before me. As you went down? <coughs> yeah. <laughs> all the way up, yeah. all the way back. I was wearing gumboots here on the way out, and <laughs> yeah, and that's what was taking me a while to get out. So I'm trying to keep them on. Heaps of shellfish over here might cut the old. Yeah, oh, get a cut on. It. Yeah. So the other guy was in the water with the life jacket, and the other guy had no life jacket. So. Couldn't swim, I don't think either, because yeah. he was floundering a fair bit when I got out there. Yeah, both of them couldn't swim at all. That was, yeah. They definitely intense. go under, man. They, were, yeah. they weren't too far from going under, I don't think. Mm. They were definitely having a hard go at it. Take right. it easy, bro. Yeah. Take, Take it easy, bro. Too much. Thank you.